Hello. I'm wasting my young years by London Grammar. Oh, so I whipped these out. I just finished the elixir a bit ago and I'm like, I gotta find the clairvoyance and I gotta lose one of the tips in my ear holes. These are actually not Dakoni tips. Look, there's a green circle because these are the tips that come with the clairvoyance. These are a $700 and $730 IM. I dropped it. And I think they were, and don't quote me on this because I, I can't remember the time frame, but these may have been the best IM I'd ever heard for a long time. Like these may have introduced me to what a high-end I am. Because my collection now is vast. And I've had these for a bit. Like, not a little bit. Like, a bit, a bit. Like, the fucking wire it still comes with a 2.5. Like, it's default to a 2.5 and it had adapters. So that's why I've got the the uh, the, the Let's Shore Chimera cable, which is a $50 upgrade for anything that you have that's 2-pin if you want to get multiple interchangeable fucking things. So click that link in the description. Anyway, these may have been... Like the first IM that made me go, huh, I may like IMs better than headphones. It took a lot to get me there. It, it took this to get me there. And wallpaper available in the horde. Don't forget to check out the uh, links to the sponsors, by the way. Huge thank you to my sponsors for this channel. Since it has such low uh, subscriber count, I'm living off them, or at least this channel is surviving off them. This has an electrostatic tribrid. I know they made up the word tribrid. I don't think that's a thing. But it's got one dynamic, which I don't know the size of. It won't say. Five balanced armatures each, and then two electrostatics each. So that's eight. That's eight drivers, if you count the, the fucking single. Like, that's absurd. That's very complicated, and I usually dislike it's $739. I don't like complication. The same in music. I'm a simpleton. I like big dynamics or big electrostats, but not like 97 things. So the fact that this was probably the first one that put all that shit in there, by the way, they're gorgeous. That put all that shit in there and I still was like, oh, so good. It's probably the reason. Because I, I put this back on my ear now. Can we, have we looked at it? Have we looked at how fucking gorgeous these things are? Just the right amount of like, hey, that looks like the ocean, but like with emeralds. If the entire ocean floor is made of like light blue emeralds. Yeah, okay, cool. They're rather large, and I that's why, because it's got eight things inside of them. Little uh, blue and red indicators on there. Weird Al's Poker Party's playing. Let's turn that up. I think it's I think it's a sound stage thing that's first and foremost. Considering they're shoving that much shit in there, the fact that everything still sounds like it's got some width to it, spectacular. I mean, we're in exactly Weird Al ain't exactly the thing I should test with. But then again, neither is uh, Bride of Chang from the Cliff Martinez made Only God Forgives soundtrack. Watch that movie. I wonder how many people, there's gotta be at least 1,500, 2,000 views in this video, right? Go watch Only God Forgives. Same guy who did Drive, same actor who did Drive. Just go watch Drive, and then Only God Forgives. Tell me what the fuck that movie's about, and if you loved it or not. Soundtrack is phenomenal, though. This is good. These IEMs are heavy. Not weight-wise, but like, like, the sa like everything coming out of them is purposeful. You, you, I didn't know, I don't remember. I certainly didn't fucking remember. I haven't used these in like eight months, a year. I don't even know. But everything that's in the goddamn song, every bit of this I am with not eight different parts, is just weighty. The bass comes in and it's like, bruh, bruh. It's, it's, you feel it. And then I don't know how they're dealing with those electrostats because they're, they're not bothersome. Is this a KZ moment where they're in there but they're not turned on? Because usually if you put two electrostats in something, I mean, we're close to Nana territory here at Price. $700, not too hard for $900, which are those nanas have two electrostats. But usually with like electrostatic things, and then you kind of like kind of like want to emphasize the, the, uh, the, the treble. Like, listen, listen to all these highs. Listen to how good our electrostats are. And these don't do that. These are a smooth, creamy, warm, loving, wide, motherfucking eight driver. There's a re they don't even end up in my box. They never even ended up in my box because I'm like, well, I'm going to use these all the time. I didn't. 
life goes on and you stop. I didn't even take the goddamn wire off. Honestly, I had this attached permanently to the wire. This is a DD Hi-Fi 2020 revision um, TC25B. Look, makes it a USB-C because I'm like, this is useless as a, tw as a two and a half. Unless I'm still using the goddamn uh, BTR5, you might as well just make it a USB-C and get it over with. And even if this is only like a $40 little DAC amp, these IMs are so good, it doesn't matter. It's gonna it's gonna shine. I am noticing I like them a little bit more on this warmer Wall 11 Topaz. She, hold on, I gotta go back. That was an organ just now. These are still one of my top five IMs. It got to the point when I do with this channel, with my whole life, my whole life, I find something that is so good. Atriums, atriums right there. ZMF atriums, $2,700. Fucking amazing. Review them, put them over there, never take them out again. Because if I keep getting reminded about how good those are, every time something that's like $1,800, $1,200, $500 comes out, I'm just going to keep thinking about, well, these aren't atriums. And I'm not, I can't afford to do that. I couldn't afford for the last year to compare everything in my head mentally to clairvoyance. Because it would, imagine if like you had to go back to the best thing ever between every session. You'd lose your fucking mind. There'd be no exuberance for anything anymore. There's a reason I stopped listening to these and there's a reason I pulled them out just now because the name of the game from the Crystal Method, the, the, the Shakers, you motherfuckers. I can feel, what's his name, dancing, Christopher Walken. I should not. That was that was name of the game. That's the name. What was the one that that Christopher Walken danced to? I think I have that in here somewhere. Was it Crystal Method? You'll find it. These are like the most aggressive, softest, smoothest, capable I am. Period. And they still compete today with all the shit in that box. All the, the 20 other things I've done, OH5s and even like Nana's, the only thing that beats that Nana beats these in is those are full chill. You can't you can't be up upheaved by that. These will still throw you in the fucking air. The Nana's are these with like two more decibels of chill. If, if you just pour chill into it. It's like you make the Powerpuff Girls and you just, you know, you accidentally knock the chill bottle over and a lot of chill goes into something. That's what Nana's do. Fuck. Now that I've listened to these again, I'm like, oh, IMs. I got to listen to other IMs now after this. Muse, Escape, right? From Showbiz. There's just a gentle, like the, the guy's doing the thing on the drum where he's just. And it's so subtle and wide and far away and it's I love the fucking clairvoyance top five I am still top five I am and now I gotta put them back on the I gotta hide them again get the fuck out of here get out of here fuck oh whoop, I lost them for another year because it's just gonna make me it's gonna make me sad every time I pull out anything else and I as much as you guys want me to like critically fucking these these you could tell when I've reviewed something that I've had loved for like a year versus something I've listened to for an hour and a half before I did the review. Especially when it's something like this. I've, I've had the, the, the excitement of this for like a new product, but this is the excitement coming back in waves of like, oh fuck, that's right, that's right, it did this, oh my God, this song. Oh, uh, to, to think I've gotten music in the last eight, nine months that I haven't heard on this hurts me. I gotta go. I gotta go find all that new music. I gotta listen to that new music on these because this is one of my favorite things. I put on this on this amp. Boy, put I'll well, put it on the on the own. I got oh, oh fuck. Sponsor link. Wallpaper in the hoard. Clairvoyance still for sale. While they're still for sale, it's gonna. I will be the saddest panda when I go to link someone to the clairvoyance and they tell me it's out of stock or they don't make it anymore. This is one of those IEMs that they should never stop making. Just never stop making it. Like the Harmonic Dine Zeus. Nothing replaces the Zeus. Keep making the Zeus till the end of fucking time. Keep making the clairvoyance until I tell you to stop. Which I won't. I promise I won't tell you to stop. My grandchildren will be like, nope, keep making them. All right, wallpaper, Patreon, subscribe, star, support this channel. Uh, check my sponsor links. We good? Cool. Cool. 
definitely need this balance cable though. Fuck, fuck that. It's beautiful cable, by the way. It's beautiful, beautiful fuck cable. Useless with a 2.5. That didn't age well at all, did it? That didn't age well at all. They're all sold out. Oh, f f 